And now meet the people who write the song hits. In a West End music publisher's office, Moira Heath, Tommy Connor and Manning Sherwin talk over their big successes. Phil Park, a musician you've often heard on the wireless, introduces them. Hello there. Well, I'd like to play for you some tunes that you all know very well, and you're invited to meet some of the people who wrote them. Now, here's Tommy Connor. Now, how long is it, Tommy, since you wrote my signature tune? I wrote St. James's Park about 15 years ago, Phil, with Art and Noel. It was one of my first big hits. And we've been friends ever since. And I never thought it would end in a fight over a woman, and a German woman at that. Oh, you mean Lily Marlena. Yes, it was rather funny that we both wrote versions of that lyric. Yes, mine sold three quarters of a million copies, but uh, I wrote a sentimental version of the song. And mine was a humorous one, but at any rate, everybody knows the tune. worked in harmony. Yes, Manning, remember who's taking you home tonight? Yes, and we did very well out of it, too. But to my mind, the loveliest tune you ever wrote was... for the writer of another lovely song, Moira Heath. Come along, Moira, and tell us all about it. Well, there really isn't much to tell. Only that you made one of the biggest successes of the war with your first song. Well, that's the funny thing, because it wasn't written as a war song at all. I wrote it some time before the war as a little thank you poem for the first weekend holiday I spent with my husband for years. Mm -hmm. 